styles, got real pace, got real variations, just really plays white ball cricket now. Body's letting himself, letting it down for red ball cricket. He can just get through a few overs, but he gets through them pretty well. And it's his birthday as well. How old is he today? 23. So all eyes on the square leg umpire. Everyone looking at the square leg umpire. It's uh, one for the over. We <laughs> had a look across to see if that was a wide or not. Overhead high is a wide. will be a wide. Now it's a no ball. It's a change in the uh, law, isn't it? The first two balls from Mills have given us an indication of the team tactic to leave out. 85 miles an hour. What I've probably said is, you know, Levy likes to get on that front foot and hit through the line, make sure he just don't float any out there. So trying to just push him back. That was the floaty one that he was looking for, but because of the two previous deliveries, he was just back a bit. Edward Mills is that you know you're going to get pace, but he's got a really good slower ball as well. You've always got to look out for. David Ripley there, far left, North Ends forever, isn't he? Wicked keeper, Leeds United fan. Good lad, old Ripley. <laughs> Been there, seen it, got the t-shirt, pretty chilled out. Now just look at that speed. Here on 90 miles an hour from Mills. Real shape for the air, but you can see he does will it there for a bit of pace. He's surprised by how quickly it comes off the surface. Yeah, the one thing that David Willey got slightly found out in those internationals, New Zealand went at him with the short ball, saying if you're going to uh, hit us, you're going to have to pull us for six, hook us for six. Cross back shots. Well, it's been an excellent start for Mills, just three runs from his first five deliveries. First six overs are going to be crucial. The Steelbacks have got to get that ball to the boundary. the cross bat shot they're not going to get many drives will he not off mills anyway 12 for none after two let's get down to our insider chris nash chris nasser upstairs